it seem like we feel the same We love what we hate We lie, but we know We can't wait to win. How to understand that what's your atmosphere right now affects your life Hello guys, this is Shundel and today's share is about understanding that what's around us right now, what's your atmosphere right now really affects your life. It can make you sad, it can make you happy, it can affect your mood. Understanding that this is very important is as well important with your life right now. If your atmosphere right now that surrounds you are grumpy and you know anger and frustrating, then your life will be also the same. So you have to understand that the atmosphere that surrounds you really affects your life. So you have a decision to make. Choose the right atmosphere for your life. Change environment. Maybe you're going to move out to the other place or maybe you're going to change the environment. You are the only one who can choose to do that. You must believe that you are good enough, strong enough, you are talented enough and capable enough of doing the great things in your life. When you are surrounded with a good atmosphere, then your talent will blossom, your blessing is abundant and much more but if your atmosphere is sour and crumpy really it also affects what is the situation of your life right now choose to live a harmonious atmosphere you have to understand that our atmosphere really affects our life. You have to understand that and you have to make a decision to change your atmosphere. It's very difficult to keep laughing when somebody is crying around you. It's very difficult to keep on being positive when the people surrounds you in your atmosphere right now are very negative and anger. You have to understand this. And how can we really understand it? We have to take action. We have to change our atmosphere. We have to move from another place. And we have, we have to do something good with ourselves. It is an action to make. It is a work to do. If you're going to live your best life, you have to choose the right atmosphere where you are right now. Change that atmosphere. Change the place. And you have to take action for your own sake. Nobody can do it for you to keep on being happy when you are surrounded of sour, angry people. You have to be aware that it is contagious. If the other people keep being angry all the time, you will become who they are as well. So you have to take note of that, that if you really want, to live your best life, you have to do something with your atmosphere where you are living right now. I am sharing with you some verse from the scripture. It helps me to understand this. I hope it can help you too. It says in the book of Proverbs 16.32, 
Who ever is slow to anger is bitter than the mighty, and he who rules his spirit than he who takes a city. This is a very difficult verse in the scripture, but we have to understand that we have a space that belongs only to us. Each and every one of us has our own space. Have you heard somebody say, Oh, I need space. Yes, you need your own space. And we must have that own special space for ourselves. And what is that? The space you are thinking. It's your thoughts, your attitude, your emotions. It's who you spend time with, with what you watch and what you listen to. That's your atmosphere. That's what you have control over. Some people live worried, offended, and negative because they lead all that into their soul. The bad news, it affects them, it affects their attitude. The negative report, the criticism, the negative co-workers, yes, it can affect who are these people in your atmosphere right now. It sours your life. Don't let other people sour your life. The problem is <clears throat> there's not ruling they're not ruling your atmosphere. They're not careful what they allow into their spirit. You can stop this by changing your new atmosphere right now. You need to keep your atmosphere full of faith, full of praise, full of hope, full of victory. Anything or anyone that tries to prison that atmosphere, you have to say no thanks. You're not welcome here. I'm not letting that offense and I'm going to stay in peace, a peaceful atmosphere give you a harmonious life you have a decision to make to choose what kind of atmosphere you are going to live right now you have the thing you can do to yourself to control your thoughts your attitude and how you respond this sour and, and angry people you have to understand that you have the ability to control your own atmosphere. You can't control others to do or say things which is not a good one. You don't have control about that. You don't have control the negative circumstances that are around you. But you can roll your spirit. You can roll yourself that you're going to stay in peace and say no to whatever tries to prison you. Control the circumstances that trying to prison your atmosphere. Yes, the negative atmosphere really affects us with our attitude and in our life but to control all these things you have to be firm enough to do what you want with your life you have to set limitation you have to do action and do some changes with your life understanding the atmosphere that surrounds us is very important it really affects your life do not welcome the negativity. Do not welcome the negative and bad circumstances. You have to set your feet 
in the ground and say no thanks. You are not welcome here. You have to choose to live in a good, peaceful atmosphere in order for you to live your best life. I know it's not just easy to transfer right away to another place or another thing or whatsoever, but you have full control in your life and you have a decision to make to choose who are these people you want to be with in order for you to stay happy, to stay positive all the time, and to have a peaceful life, and to have a peaceful heart and mind. This is just a share, a reminder to each and every one of us. I'm not perfect, and everything is very difficult when it comes to changes. But you can roll your own life to the life you want to be. To stay happy all the time, you have to take action what is best for your life right now now this is Yundel. thank you for listening thank you for dropping here in my channel i am very grateful to each and every one of you i love you all and goodbye like we feel the same we